Max. I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. I can. I'm just so glad she didn't. Are you okay? I'm just like shocked. I've never seen anybody try to kill themselves before. Me neither. I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Where did she go? I know I can trust you since you were so nice asking about my mom in the hospital, but Victoria will like make my life hell if I blab, okay? No doubt. I do hope your mother gets better. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. You're like weird, but pretty cool, Max. Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Hey, Max. I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. I know. Victoria must be upset since I saw her sneaking out of the dorm past curfew. Oh man, like, you saw her? She was so, like, nervous when she left the dorm. She wouldn't even tell me where she was going. Probably to hell. Well, I have to go crash. <laughs> it's been a rough day, as you know. Thanks, Max. And it was, like, pretty awesome when you went up to the roof to save Kate. Victoria was wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Jeez, Taylor actually seems concerned about Kate. I like really do need to get some sleep, Max. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detective, I might as well search for clues about what really happened to Kate at the Vortex Club party. My cookies? Victoria stole my cookies! Now I can't take them back because she'll know I did it! Victoria's a cookie monster. Those boots are made for walking runways. These socks cost more than my wardrobe. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Say nut. Gotcha. Everybody's asleep. I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. Good evening, fish fish.
Thanks, fish. Nice work. Ew, gross. At least switch to E6. Chloe, say hello to my little friend. Say goodnight to the bad guy. Check out Mad Max. <laughs> Ready to fucking thrash. I'm so hardcore. Oh, look at the poor bird. Seems kind of freaked out. Bird, be gone. Fly, you fool. Oh, look at the poor bird. Seems kind of freaked out. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. I'd love to do a whole big rig photo series. Hey, no photo girl. That would be cool to be a trucker for a while. Always on the road. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around here. And I have bills to pay. Time is money to a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of Arcadia Bay. Whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, and a slut trying to commit suicide. Maybe you should leave then. What if I could? And even that shifty Rachel What's-Her-Face asked me once if I'd drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Hey, how's it going? Peachy, interview over. Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitchin' 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel? She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers. Or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those you-know-who-know-whats. Good riddance. But... You can take pictures of my truck anytime. 
Take care. Let's talk about my photo shoot later. 10-4. I made the trucker happy, and I get to photograph this bitch in 1977 Needham. That's a big 10 4, Max. Tornadoes, snowfall. Eclipses? Now dying animals? Holy shit. Look at that. It's so sad and disturbing and beautiful at once. What an amazing shot. So ominous. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. That's true. <laughs> 